Okay, what's going on everybody and welcome. Today we are covering a really big topic, uh, hair thinning. We're gonna walk through some hair loss treatments, some systems, some products, some things that you need to be aware of. I'm gonna break down what they are, some pros and cons to them, and ultimately help you decide if they're a good process for you or a good option for you. And if you know me, you know that today I am not in the woods, which is weird, because usually I have you on some adventure while I'm teaching you about hair, but today, the adventure lands us in the salon, which I just realized doesn't look anything like a salon. <laughs> Enough of that, let's talk about hair thinning. Okay, so today's video is sponsored by iRestore. I'm really excited to have them sponsor this, but we're gonna talk a little bit more about that a little bit later. So we're gonna start with hair transplants. Now, what are they? Hair transplants on a simple form is where a doctor will actually surgically remove hair follicles that are still growing hair and then they will transplant them into the head where your hair follicles are no longer growing hair. So do they work? Without question, absolutely they work. So what about pros and cons? So you have to recognize that this is a process that is going to cost you think thousands of dollars. And depending on how much hair loss you're struggling with and how specific you wanna get with the procedure that you undergo, you could be looking at a higher end thousands of dollars number. So it's gonna be up to you if that price makes sense for you. There's also the more common, I would say, process where they actually remove a section of scalp in your nape. So in the back of your head, they'll cut out a section of scalp, they cinch that together, so they actually close that gap, they stitch it back up across the back, and then they remove the follicles from that area. Typically that's because in many cases when we're talking about male or female pattern baldness, we're dealing with an area where the nape will continue to grow hair. So that is typically a good place to pull follicles from and then they'll transplant them in the areas, usually up in the crown and in the top where hair has a tendency to thin or wherever it's thinning for you. Now the issue with that is, let's say you just started to thin, it may fill that in but the other follicles that were eventually going to stop growing hair will actually stop growing. So it's a process that many times will have to be repeated multiple times. That means that the price goes up, but also more importantly, it means you can only take so many sections from back here before you start raising your hairline really high because every time they take this section, they raise that up and each time that neckline goes a little higher, a little higher and a little higher. So like I said, there are definitely different ways to go about this process. Some that don't use that method at all and are actually very effective and they look very natural, but just remember this is going to be costly without question. Another thing that you wanna think about is that it is still surgery. So because it's a level of surgery, some people, you may be one of them, that just don't feel comfortable with the in and out processes of surgery. So for you, this may or may not be really a good option. Now let's move on to some options that are a little bit less invasive. Okay, so I said at the very beginning of this video that this video is sponsored by Ivory Store and I'm actually really excited to work with them because they sent me a product that I have been wanting to try for so long. So let's take a look at what it is and then we'll kind of walk through the process of how it works. They sent me some hair gummy vitamins with have a bunch of good stuff in it, biotin, antioxidants, vitamin C and E, coconut oil, a bunch of stuff just for the hair, skin and nails, really. Yeah, it says hair, skin and nails on it. They gave me a portal battery for this little system that we're about to show you here in a second. There's also a full line of hair care. They've got a shampoo, they've got a conditioner, they also have a serum that you actually use, that's right, yes, an anti-hair loss serum, as well as this right here, which is a three-in-one growth hair formula. So they sent me all of this stuff to try. I'm gonna definitely be giving that a shot over the next six months. But here is the real kind of king of the show. Oh my gosh, let me get this up here. This is a laser hair device that helps to regrow hair. Yes, this is something that you wear for just 25 minutes every other day and the lasers and the LED work some magic and boom, you get hair regrowth. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna open it up. You're probably not gonna wanna watch this. So let me get this out here and I'll show you exactly how this is gonna work. Okay, so this is the device. Now, they sent me the actual professional one versus the essential one. The professional one has 282 LEDs and lasers, whereas the essential has 51. So this has more sides and back coverage as well. And it has these pads in here, which is gonna give it more comfort, that's nice. And you can see that because of these pads, it's gonna create a little bit more airflow in here. What also I think is really cool about this one specifically is that it uses lasers and LED technology, not just LED technology. So it's really taking everything kind of to the next level. 
The light energy that comes from these lasers is absorbed by the hair follicle, and this produces an improved cell metabolism and enhanced energy production. Basically, this stimulates faster growth of thicker, fuller, stronger hair. So this is basically like watering a plant that hasn't been watered for a long time. Why I wanted to try this so bad is because one, it's FDA cleared, but there are like 19,000 five-star reviews on this thing. So I just really think there's a lot of positives behind this. I definitely like the fact that it's not surgery, so I don't have to worry about going in and having surgery done and then finding out later on that it's still thinning and now I have to go have surgery again. This is something that I can just continue to use. Okay, so how does this device actually work? Well, it's really simple. Okay, so you take this cord that comes with the device and you plug it into the power adapter. Boom, then you plug the power into an outlet. Once you get that, what you're gonna see is this 25 is gonna pop up. It's already set for 25 minutes like we talked about. It won't actually start functioning until you put the device on. So if I take it now, I'm gonna put this on. I'm just gonna position it comfortably right on the top of my head, okay? So, oh yeah, that is comfortable. All right, cool. When you hit the play pause button, it beeps and then you can see that it starts to count down from 25. I'm legitimately <laughs> excited about this. I don't even have severe thinning, but these little areas in the front have actually bugged me a little bit, just a little bit. So to think that they can actually fill in, I'm stoked to see what this does in the next few months. Then if you wanna turn it off, it's simple. You just hit the power button for three seconds. One, two, three, and boom, it turns off. Done deal. Yeah, I'm super excited to try this. So if you want more information on this, they're actually supplied me with a discount code that you can use that will be in the description below. So definitely check that out. Now let's move on to the next options. Okay, so the next thing I wanna talk about are products that have minoxidil in them. Now you probably know of the product Rogaine. I feel like that's the most kind of commonly known product that deals with this. These are products that you usually apply when you get out of the shower, you work it through your scalp, wherever you're going thin, and it helps to regrow that hair. Do they work? I have absolutely seen clients that utilize products that have minoxidil in them and saw fantastic results. So I definitely know that it works and I don't think that that's like an uncommon understanding for people. So what do you wanna think about before you jump into one? So there are a host of side effects that potentially could arise. It's gonna be up to you as to whether or not it's the risk that you wanna take for those. So we've basically talked about how you deal with hair thinning on kind of a long-term basis. What about the day-to-day? -day? What if you wanna be able to mitigate the concern of thinning hair immediately on a day-to-day -day basis? Well, then we move into something like this. These are hair fibers. I love these. I've actually talked about this in another video before. This is something that you can use that's going to basically put a Band-Aid on the bullet wound. It will not address your hair thinning. It will simply disguise the fact that it is thinning. So to me, something like this is something you actually use, honestly, in conjunction with one of the other processes. I will use it in conjunction with the iRestore device. So this, on a day-to-day -day basis, will kind of create the illusion of more density, while at the same time, I'm actually addressing the root problem and helping to grow more of that hair and create more density. So eventually, I'll wean myself off of this, basically. Now, the way these work, are they're very simple. You get different colors of these, depending on your hair color, and you simply get your hair styled, get out of the shower, top out your hair, get it all styled the way you want, and then you get in the mirror and you spray this on, and this is a very light, dusty kind of fiber that will attach and actually make your hair look denser and thicker. Now, the reason that I love it is because one, when you rub your fingers in it, it doesn't leave a bunch of film on your hands to make them look dirty. It's kind of like it's just not there. At night or the next day when you shampoo or whenever the next time you shampoo is, boom, it's gone. And then you reapply. The one thing I will say about these is typically these will come with kind of a shaker style top, not this actual pump. I bought this pump as an extra add-on, but the pump absolutely makes a huge difference. You can see that fine mist makes a huge difference in the application. Otherwise, you're left doing this action and trying to kind of put this on like a salt shaker, which is really frustrating and it's really hard to get very specific around your hairline. So to me, this is just a much better option. And again, if you wanna learn more about the Iris store, make sure you go below and click on that link. You're gonna get a discount, which is super nice. Otherwise, what I need you to do right now is watch this video so that I always say, you can learn more. And if you like this at all, got any value, there's a subscribe button. It's like right there. Mm -hmm. Hit that. Subscribe. Every Tuesday, brand new video, more insight. 
Love to have you hang out. Join the fam. <laughs> All right, you have a fantastic one and we will see you next Tuesday. See you later, bye. I feel like I should use this right now. Can you see? I don't even know where this is spraying. I'm pretty sure this is spraying just on my forehead. My forehead's probably black right now, isn't it? Is it black? Oh, it probably it's probably black. Is it black? I can't even tell. Oh boy, it probably is. Oh, that's gonna suck. Wait a minute, let me see. Yep. No, I think it is. <laughs>